Don't cry to give up. Cry to keep going. Don't cry to quit. You already in pain. You already hurt. Get a reward from it. Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small The fruit of everything good in life begins with a challenge. Everything worthwhile is uphill. Your dreams are there, your hopes are there. Most people, they don't leave their life, they accept their life. Here's the issue. Most people, they have uphill hopes, but they have downhill habits. And you can't go uphill with downhill habits. It's pretty easy to get the mindset that there's nothing you can do about it, that you're overwhelmed, that you can't change the world. Well, you know what you can change? You can change you. You can change your world. And if you change your world and you make yourself better and you make your part of the world better, the rest of the world will follow. Good intentions are overrated. I know so many people, well, I'm going to do that. Yes, I think that's a good idea. I think I'm going to do that. So good intentions are the most overrated phrase in the world. Nothing happens until you've got good actions. And it's not going to come to you and it's not going to fall in your lap. And it's not going to be something that, oh my gosh, it just was so simple. It's always going to be difficult. Look, I'd love to sugarcoat this thing for you. I'd love to tell you, look, you can go out here and get rich, do a couple of things, they ain't happen. You got to get real doggish. You got to get downright funky if you want to make it. Most of you won't be successful because when you're studying and you get tired, you quit. Weakness haunts us all. The times we could have done more. They eat at your self-esteem. They rob you of your self-respect. They diminish your belief in your potential. The true art of a full life is to minimize those moments when your weak thoughts win the battle and maximize your ability to rise and grind. Most of you say you want to be successful, but you don't want it bad. You just kind of want it. You don't want it badder than you want to party. You don't want it as much as you want to be cool. And I'm here to tell you today, if you're going to be successful, rise and grind. If you want it to happen, get your butt up and make it happen. And sometimes if you're going to be successful, it's not how smart you are. It's not how strong you are. It's how much you can out stuff. Success is not a comfortable procedure. It is a very uncomfortable thing to attempt. So you got to get comfortable being uncomfortable if you ever want to be successful. Start putting some pressure on. Put some pressure on yourself. Get out here and get about it. Don't cry to give up. Cry to keep going. Don't cry to quit. You already in pain. You already hurt. Get a reward from it. Some of y'all, you not getting close to the vision. You didn't say the vision and your mama said something about it, so you didn't backed off. You didn't say something about the vision and somebody tried to kill you and you didn't backed off. Are you hearing what I'm trying to tell you? I'm telling you that you got to be possessed with the vision. You want to make your dream come true, you got to stay focused. Some people rather get even than get ahead. Stay focused on where you want to go. I just kept on doing what I was supposed to do. So you've got to work on it. When other folk are having a good time, you've got to have the strength of character to concentrate, to read, to digest information. To be able at any moment to sacrifice what you are for what you will become. You have to give it everything you got. No more TV, no more parties, no more playing. What you need to be doing is studying. While they was golfing, I was studying. While they was shooting hoops, I was studying. While they was playing games and sitting up and eating and joking in the restaurant, I was studying. You have to put your everything, your everything, your mind, your energy, your effort, your discipline. Nothing is going to jump out the fire if you don't throw something in there. It's not going to happen. I got to commit my very being to this thing. I got to breathe it. I got to eat it. I got to sleep it. You got to begin with the end in mind. So whatever your dream or your goal is, you got to wake up every day to it. You got to go to bed with it. You got to read stuff. The music you listen to, everything you do got to pour into that dream. You got to stay focused on your dream. Don't allow anyone to pull you off the game plan. When they're having fun, you grind. When they're chilling, you work your ass off. When they're getting lit, you put in more work. And when they're wishing for a better lifestyle, you'll be living it.
kill you.